Virgo. This is a peek at your partner for the week of October the 3rd through October the 7th, 2023. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Virgo for October the 3rd through October the 7th, 2023. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Virgo for October the 3rd through October the 7th, 2023. Universal Energies, show me what I need to see for the partner of the star sign of Virgo for October the 3rd through October the 7th, 2023 show me you guys subscribe like comment and share these videos if this does not resonate with you check your moon rising and venus sign videos i do not read reversals if you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Virgo. Virgo, this is a peek at your partner. So, Virgo, your partner has the Seven of Pentacles. Your partner has the Knight of Cups. Your partner has the Eight of Swords. Your partner has... The lovers and your partner has the tower so Virgo your partner has a seven of Pentacles Taurus Virgo Capricorn this is your partner waiting and in this wait they're pausing to reflect on you guys' relationship they're looking at the seeds that were planted looking at what has taken root what has grown and what it has produced thus far trying to figure out whether or not they want to continue to invest whether they want to reinvest they're taking stock of you guys' relationship, assessing you guys' relationship. But this is also a card of your partner looking at their coins, their harvest, their bank account, looking at how much they have and how much they have to invest. Could be waiting on money. So listen, Virgo, your partner could be waiting on money, looking at their coins, looking at their bank account. Your partner could tell me that they're waiting. Your partner could tell me that they're waiting, contemplating, and debating on whether or not they care to continue to invest or reinvest in this relationship. Clarify the seven of pentacles for Virgo's partner. Clarify the seven of pentacles for Virgo's partner. Clarify the seven of pentacles for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the seven of wands. Aries, Leora Sag, this is your partner being defensive. They're on the defense, but this can also speak to them being put in a position where they're having to defend themselves against rumors, gossip, and other people's opinions. Now, this can be your partner shunning someone, fighting someone off, setting boundaries with someone, but this is also an accusatory card. So your partner could be being accused of some type of rumors and gossip, and they're giving their defense or excuse here. So listen, Virgo, your partner could tell me that they're off and shunning and setting boundaries or they're trying to come in and explain, give the explanation, excuse or defense here. Now, your partner could tell me that they're very defensive here when it comes to their coins. Could be a situation going on with their coins here. Your partner could tell me that they're kind of standoffish and wanting to wait with something here and telling someone to back up off me. Give me time. I need to wait. Wait a minute. Wait. Virgo, listen, your partner could tell me that, you know, they're setting some type of boundaries here because they're asking themselves whether or not they care to continue to invest or reinvest in this relationship. Virgo, your partner could also tell me that they're waiting to come in to explain, give the explanation, excuse, or defense here. Virgo, your partner has the Knight of Cups, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is someone coming into your partner or your partner coming in to apologize, to offer their cup of love and make the romantic gesture. So someone is saying, I'm sorry. Someone is trying to heal things, mend things, work things out, may even be coming in with a romantic gesture here. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Virgo's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Virgo's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups. For Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the Three of Pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. 
This is making plans to meet up, making plans to partner up, to work together on a contract or a project. This is teamwork. This is collaboration. Now this can speak to there being a third party involved, but this can also speak to your partner being willing to work on it or put in the work. So Virgo, listen, this could all be work or business for your partner. Your partner could tell me that they're willing to work on it, willing to put in the work. Your partner could tell me that this is some type of an agreement or a contract collaboration, or there's a third party. Now, Virgo, listen, your partner could tell me that this is all work or business here, some type of an agreement, some type of good news may be coming in, and maybe they're setting some type of boundaries or kind of standoffish and wanting to wait or think about the, what is being offered here. Your partner could also tell me that there was a third party at one point, but someone's apologizing. Now, they can tell, the, tell you that, hey, I need some space while I think about whether or not I care to continue to invest here. Or is them wanting to come in to explain, give the explanation, excuse the defense, and apologize for having a third party? Someone could also be wanting to apologize and work things out here, okay? Virgo, your partner has the Eight of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is your partner feeling stuck. Like they're in a self-imposed prison of their thoughts. This is your partner feeling like they can't move, but they can move because it's all mental. This is them refusing to see some things, refusing to acknowledge some things, a lack of information, block communication. This is your partner feeling stuck, trapped, and blocked. So Virgo, listen, your partner could tell me that they're feeling stuck in a situation or there's blocked communication. Clarify the eight of swords for Virgo's partner. Clarify the eight of swords. For Virgo's partner. Clarify the Eight of Swords for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the Emperor. Could be dealing with an Aries or a Taurus, but the Emperor is someone who runs empires. This is a boss, a business owner, CEO, independent contractor, manager. This is usually an older gentleman. It doesn't have to be, but someone who's wise yet stern. Someone who wants complete control and authority. Could be dealing with this Aries or a Taurus. Could be dealing with a spouse because the emperor is a married, stable, committed person. Could be dealing with the parent of your child because the emperor is a father figure. Could also be dealing with someone you work with or do business with. But this could also be work or business for your partner. Clarify the emperor for Virgo's partner. Clarify the emperor for Virgo's partner. Clarify the emperor for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the nine of pentacles. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is your partner saying with, without, or in spite of anyone. I alone in my own right am abundant, self-sufficient, independent, and single. I'm single. So Virgo, listen, your partner could tell me that they're independently abundant on their own or they're single. Now listen, your partner could tell me that they're stuck concerning a decision that they have to make concerning work or business and their coins here, these coins here, some type of an agreement and good news coming in. However, Virgo, your partner could tell me that they're stuck on whether or not they want to remain single or not. Because someone could be coming in to apologize here, but someone could also be coming in with a proposal wanting to go into some type of an agreement here. So it may make them question whether or not they want to remain single. Virgo, your partner could tell me that, you know what, I'm just blocking everything out and I'm just going to be single. Virgo, your partner has the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini, but the lover says, you know, I breathe you in, you breathe me in. We are so magnetically attracted to one another. We cannot get enough of one another. Babe, I need to make a choice. So Virgo, could be dealing with a Gemini, but your partner could tell me that you guys have this strong twin flame magnetic pull. Your partner could tell me there's another other lover, but the lovers could also be a partnership with work or business. Clarify the lovers for Virgo's partner. Clarify the lovers for Virgo's partner. Clarify the lovers for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the world. So your partner may be at a distance from you, either emotionally or physically at a distance. Your partner may have traveled recently or will travel in the near future. But the world symbolizes closing out a cycle to start a new cycle, closing out a chapter to start a new chapter. So Virgo, listen, your partner could tell me that there's distance between you guys, emotional distance or geographical distance. 
Your partner could tell me that a cycle is closing out completely or someone is wanting to come back around again. Clarify the world for Virgo's partner. Clarify the world for Virgo's partner. Clarify the world for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the moon. Could be dealing with a Pisces. But the moon symbolizes secrets or things that are not yet known. It can symbolize moodiness, depression, vivid dreams, deep emotions, intuition, but secrets. Could be dealing with a Pisces, but your partner could tell me that they're in the dark concerning something. Your partner could tell me that they're using the intuition or there's a secret. Clarify the moon for Virgo's partner. Clarify the moon for Virgo's partner. Clarify the moon for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the Knight of Cups again. So someone's coming in to apologize here, okay? Or coming in with some type of romantic gesture, Virgo. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Virgo's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Virgo's partner. Clarify the Knight of Cups for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but the star symbolizes having hope, having faith, healing, getting their wish, being divinely guided, following their destiny, destiny. So listen, Virgo, could be dealing with an Aquarius, but your partner could tell me that they're getting their wish, following their destiny. Your partner could tell me that they need to heal individually on their own, or they're holding out hope and faith that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out and reconcile. Clarify the star for Virgo's partner. Clarify the star for Virgo's partner. Clarify the star for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the Nine of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is wish fulfillment. But this can also speak to your partner feeling smug or overindulging in alcohol or substance abuse. So listen, Virgo, your partner could tell me that they're getting their wish, wish. Could be feeling smug here or overindulging, trying to numb out. Now, Virgo, listen, you know, they very well could be getting their wish here with some type of partnership with work or business. But maybe they're using their intuition, they're thinking on it, okay? Some type of good news coming in. And the thing about it is, it could be some type of travel involved here. The star is a travel card and so is the world. It could be some type of travel involved here with this work or business. Your partner could tell me that you guys have this strong twin flame magnetic pull and wanting to come back around again to one another after some type of secret came out. Someone's apologizing and trying to heal this here. This very well may be their wish, okay? The thing is, I don't know if it's their secret and they're wanting to come in and explain, give the explanation, excuse or defense here and apologize and work things out with you or it's your secret and they're kind of keeping you at bay, setting some type of boundaries and waiting and contemplating whether or not they care to continue to invest here. So kind of dragging it out. Virgo, your partner has the tower. The tower is Aries and Scorpio's energy. This is something that your partner doesn't see coming. Something that catches them completely off guard. Something that just rocks the foundation of you guys' relationship. This is a shock in our moment. A moment of revelation. Now this can be a shocking shakeup or a breakup. So Virgo, very well could be a shocking surprise. Shocking revelation. Something being revealed or a breakup. Clarify the tower. For Virgo's partner. Clarify the tower for Virgo's partner. Clarify the tower for Virgo's partner. It is clarified with the Five of Cups. Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. This is your partner feeling remorse and regret, hurt, crying on the inside over all the time that has spilled out, all the effort and energy that has spilled out, all the love that has spilled out. This is your partner mourning the loss of this relationship, disappointed on how things pan out in the relationship. So Virgo, listen, your partner could tell me that they're hurt, they're mourning, they're disappointed here. However, they could be feeling remorse and regret for the part that they played. Now Virgo, very well could have been a shocking shakeup, something being revealed, some type of secret coming out here about there being another other lover here and your partner's heart hurt, mourning and disappointed 
And it's them keeping you at bay trying to think about whether or not they care to continue to invest or reinvest in this relationship because you're the one who is apologizing, trying to work things out here. However, Virgo, your partner could tell me it was a shocking shakeup and a breakup over this shocking revelation of a secret of them having another other lover. And they're feeling remorse and regret for the part that they played. And they're hoping, and this is their wish that you guys can heal things, mend things, work things out. They want to come in and apologize and work things out here. So they want to come in to explain, give the explanation, excuse or defense here. And they may even be waiting, okay, on a response after trying to explain to you, Virgo. Virgo, I'm going to take a look at the Hidden Truth Oracle for your partner. And so, it says, my life is not as together as it seems. My life is not as together as it seems. What else for Virgo's partner? What else for Virgo's partner? <laughs> okay, I want you. So they may have messed up pretty bad, Virgo. And they're just waiting on you to give, give them the green light here. If you're interested in a private reading, you can reach me at herimmortalmajesty at gmail.com. Virgo, this is a peek at your partner for October the 3rd through October the 7th, 2023. You guys, give me feedback. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. And follow me on Twitter at herimmortalmaj, M-A-J. And I'll see you guys next week. Peace.